What's up my ponyos, Andy with Andy Vlogs. Excited to share with you guys this content. Here's the title suggests we're gonna be going over the walnut case from the folks at Mouse. Now this is the Limitless 5.0. We'll go over what that means. Uh, but what's really exciting here is that uh, Mouse has come out with a whole bunch of products for the iPhone 14 series. This is gonna be from the iPhone 14 Pro Max. There are a myriad of other different cases uh, for the other phones that you guys can check out as well. With that said, I, I honestly, I love the Walnut and as uh, as they had it from last year, it's just, it's just such a cool piece. You pull it out of your wallet, you're in school, you know, you're in a study group, you're, you're at a work meeting and uh, it really does turn head. So this is something that I'm really excited to be able to see. We will show off the differences from last year to this year and show you what that Walnut veneer is gonna look like. With that said, this is not a sponsored video. I did purchase this with my own money. Um, down below in the links in the description will be the product pricing and availability. They do help out the channel. So if you don't mind helping, I would appreciate it. Let's go ahead and jump into it. So we've got the mouse case and uh, I, I've been corrected since last year. It's mouse. I thought it was Moe's, M-O-U-S. Uh, but this is one of my favorite uh, product companies that put out uh, iPhone products. They also put out products for your Samsung and other products, but uh, they're just a great all around comp company. What's cool here is they're a, like a climate positive company. So all of the uh, products you see here are from recyclable material and they are obviously recyclable. Oh, this is so cool. I like how they did this this year. They always provide you this little uh, warning in, in the event that you have, you know, a pacemaker or something that uh, might be uh, sensitive to a magnetic field they always provide that their presentation is always astounding i love it careful care of attention they provide you everything you need all in one go i love that i just want to keep this because it's such a cool case but don't forget please recycle it with that said it looks like it's uh very much the same build as last year um where you've got the veneer here basically glued into the polycarbonate case this is a, a strong TPC and polycarbonate material, which means around the edges is your polycarbonate. Uh, on, on the back side here, where it gives you your most structure is your TPC uh, material. I can already notice uh, a few differences from last year to this year. They've got a grip. It looks like you've got your wrist strap on both sides, which is really cool. And then last year didn't have this core. Uh, we'll go over that in a second. But first impressions, look at that veneer. I love walnut. Walnut is my favorite wood to work with. I made a walnut pen and a walnut jewelry box when I was in high school. And I just, I just have a kingship to it. I like to use a darker lacquer, but that lacquer is just nice. You can see the grain. And what's so cool is this is such high quality wood. You can even see some of the grain in there. It's really great. Careful attention here to detail around the edge for your camera module as well as around the edges here um, on the inside. Um, they, they're taking a different approach than Nomad. Nomad's definitely their direct uh, competitor here. Uh, the green you see there is actually rubber. So they provide you a rubber uh, material on the inside in the event of a bump, a drop, it's gonna provide you that comfort and satisfaction. They said something about 10 foot drop and hundreds of, of drops without any breaks. I'm not gonna be testing that out here right now. Uh, but just know that they have tested that. You got MagSafe compatibility, which is great. You've got the anchor there. And then, like I said, you've got this protective, it's like it's like a microfiber material here that's uh, spongy. So it's supposed to provide you some additional protection there. So guaranteed those three things, you've got the ridging here around the edge. You've got the, the wrist strap on both sides and you've got the um, protection here lined on the inside. That's what makes up the 5.0 from last year. Uh, speaking of last year, I'm going to show you what the case looks like um, from last year to this year. The tooling looks very, very similar, but you can already notice here 4.0 did not include any microfiber. This is just the TPC. There was no uh, lining of any soft material here. Both of them have MagSafe, which is fine. The other difference is the grip. Like I said, you've got that wavy grip and then you only have it on the wrist strap mount on one side. Otherwise, it's it's an identical case from last year. Same model, 
probably the same injection molds, just adding the tooling on the... Uh, I know it's a different injection mold because that's, that's there. With that said, let's go ahead now and add it to the case and show you what that looks like. Very, very slick, very easy uh, putting into the case. Uh, as you can see, it's a little bit thicker. This is probably a sixteenth of an inch, making it about an eighth to a quarter of an inch thick uh, around the edges. The bezel is definitely bigger. Um, it does lip up, which is nice. So even if you have a screen protector like I do, it will not encroach on it. It'll butt up right against it. It's raised so that when it lands on its face, it doesn't scratch. What's also cool is you'll notice here that they have a chin and uh, they have a bezel for the chin and forehead meaning that it, it does lip up a little bit higher. Hopefully I can get that on this. Uh, you can kind of see it. I can't get the, yeah, there we go. As you can see there, it does have that lip. So it's kind of cool that they have that engineering. It's thicker on the forehead and the chin. And then obviously on the camera, uh, you've got the little lip there as well that provides you that protection. Looks great. Buttons are not metallic, which is unfortunate. They are clicky, however. They are plastic. I can't get that one to click. Hmm. You do have an opening for your do not disturb. And then on the bottom side, like I said, speaker grill, lightning port. Looks good. All right, that's, that's about it here in a nutshell. I do wanna show you a couple of products that it is compatible with. If you wanted to pick up the Apple Duo, it fits just perfectly like there. Seems like it's battery is a little bit, or the magnet is a little bit stronger than the Nomad. The Nomad, it did fall. I have a third party um, battery charger, MagSafe Qi charging. Looks great. This is a little bit thicker. This is a 9,000 milliamp from iWalk. You got a button here to show you the digital charge. And then you can also go with the, uh, the OG, oops, the OG MagSafe battery pack. It looks just fine. 2,000 milliamps, pretty good. But looks great. I mean, you have this on your desk. Um, you know, the walnut on this fake. This isn't this isn't real wood. It's just a, a fake veneer. But you've got this real walnut that looks really, really good. Put it on your desk. Have it as a desk buddy. It looks great. With that said, my pungyos, um, that's about it. It's a very, very impressive product. Something that I highly recommend that you put on your list. If you don't want to go leather uh, and you wanted something that's more robust, you want that 5.0. A limitless uh, protection this is something I definitely highly recommend it is it is a better product from last year which I'm impressed about so if that's something you're interested in this comes in all colors and sizes uh, sizes and shapes I prefer the walnut I'm also doing a review of the the black leather so please consider checking that out down below in the links in the description will be the product price and availability for not only this case but all of the other products that we showcase hit that like button and uh, don't forget to subscribe because I do go live every week showcasing all the products here. Thanks so much for watching guys. We'll catch you on the next one.